Hello! Hi and welcome to some more FTL Captain's Edition with me, the Zero. Ah, okay, well, this is a very special episode. Because this might be it. We have hope. We might beat the final boss. Let's get in there. Okay. This is our ship. Hope. Now we need to go to the next sector, the final battle. Will will we will this be it? Will we finally beat Captain's Edition on hard mode with the Kestrel A? Yeah, we we've read this so many times. Four oil point repair, ten fuel. I oh, didn't give us any scrap though. Okay, mm. uh, let's talk to. Who do you want to talk to? Maybe Bazaxabil? Hey Bazaxabil! The ancient crew member forms a part of its arm into a metallic flower and present it to you. Sign of appreciation adequate? You politely thank the being for the strange present, made from its own body. Will the Angie want to have that thing back at some point? I don't know. You tell me, Bazaxabil. Okay. Where's the base? The base is down here. There's a couple of repair points along the way. We're gonna try to hit them. Let's hit here, that repair point. Down there. Let's try to hit that repair point. Alright. Let's try it. What do we got? Sisters indicate that the rebels are setting up a forward jump beacon behind a nearby planet's moon. More importantly, a number of ships are passing by. Prepare for a fight. Okay. What have they got? They got some drones, they got some not too nasty weapons, they have a cloning bay, a ton of shields. Now the safest thing to do would be to hack their weapons, or their drone. Let's see what kind of drones they got. Just hacking. Do we wanna, oh they have a teleporter bomb, okay. We're gonna hack their weapons. Okay, very good. We're gonna get ready to... This is gonna shoot at... Their shields, their weapons. Take down the weapons first. Shoot down, shoot that down at their weapons. And just in a moment... We're gonna... Mind control that pilot. There we go. Okay. Scatter flak gun. Fire, and then let's start damaging the guy in the weapons room. There we go. Very good. It's a good first. There we go. Nice loads of damage. Right now we want to spread the damage around. We don't want to concentrate the damage. If at all possible, because they got that cloning bay. There we go. We don't want to kill any of them just yet. We want them all on really low health. That way when next salvo we're going to take down the cloning bay, then we can start killing them. Okay, let's get ready. Oh, that missed. Okay. Uh, you still have a lot of health. There we go. We can wait. We're not in a hurry right here, unless they, they start to want to jump. And I don't think they will. What we need to do is mind control the pilot again so they can't dodge. There we go. That thing's dead. We can start killing them. There we go. Now, we need to start killing them. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, that missed. If these two shots hit... No, only one of them hit. There we go. Very good. Now they won't be able to dodge anymore. Just in a moment. There we go. Oh, this guy's gonna be able to repair this. Okay, we need to mind control him. Don't repair that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, that was not... I didn't do that properly. Ah, crap. I didn't do that properly. Uh... There we go. He's repairing. Um... We just need to wait for our light laser here. Ah, they're fighting. Okay, no, they're both repairing. There we go, another one dead. Now we just need to make sure that this does not get repaired. Oh, he's got repaired. Nope, not repaired. Very good. There we go. Captured ship. Hey, baby J. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Welcome! Um, I'm really excited, and also, I'm really excited about XCOM 2, and there's gonna be some cool thing coming out tomorrow for XCOM 2, also. But, um, right now, I want to concentrate on, on, on FTL, because we might finally beat the final boss. That might happen tonight, with hope. And I really hope it happens. Alright, 33 scrap, deep space gemstones. Okay. We could probably sell that. Um, oops. 33 scrap. That's not enough to do anything, sadly. Oh, a store. We could have the repair and then the store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Repair. Free scrap. Store. Sell the stuff. Oh, my God. 23. Oh, that, that gave us a lot. <gasps> you barely detach from the station when all hell breaks loose. A rebel gunboat formation jumps directly to the base perimeter and opens fire into the installation with its pre-ignited arsenal. You engage a closed ship at request fire support from the base. Do they actually have a weapons pre-igniter? No, they don't. Okay. Don't scare me with that sort of stuff, game. They are invisible. That's gonna be... Oh, they have an ASB. And they're teleporting in. Okay, let's go fight this. Oh my god, that's a very long... We might have to jump out of here. That's such a long cloak. Oh. Incoming bombs, huh? If those do damage, that's not good. ABS target locked. Oh my god. No, I'm not happy about this. Did it... Okay, it just damaged the weapons a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna hack their weapons just in case. The ASB is coming though. And that is the worst of news. The ASB miss? Oh no, the ASB is targeting them? Oh! Why am I scared? No, we can take these guys! Oh man, we can totally take these guys! Yeah, 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 yeah! Do they have any healing? They have a healing. Did we, did we kill the guys that were on the... Oh man, that's... Easy. Uh, we probably want to take down that freaking thing right here.
There we go. And... That's not even out yet. Ooh, we need some oxygen. Thank you. We need some healing as well. Okay. Um, we probably want to take down their weapons. Yeah. Oh, shields, come back. Yeah, okay. Now those bombs are going to be annoying. Oh, my God. Oh, that, that thing, though, huh? If it's timed properly... Yeah, we took a hit. Okay. Scatter flag. Free asset, danger close. You narrowly avoid a friendly ASB barrier from an impact into another rebel ship below you. Don't be danger close. That's the rule. The rule is don't be danger close, guys. Okay, Soul Moose. Go get healed. Baby J. Baby J, go get healed. Okay, what's happening? <sighs> this weapon's gonna fire, but as long as it's not in sync... Yeah, we can take this ship. We can totally take this ship. We need to disable their healing right now. SB target lock, yeah, but it's not friendly. Okay, we destroyed that. Now, we need this guy to not repair this. Very importantly. Yeah, everyone back to your stations. Oh, that's a nice ASB right on their weapons. You can kill this guy. There we go. Very nice. Things are good. Things are good. We can kill this guy right here. There we go. We just have one more to kill. Maybe it's target lock. Yeah, but it's not on me. Don't scare me like that. Okay, we can hack their weapons, might as well. We can hurt this guy. A little bit. Oh, but the ABS is gonna kill them! ABS, don't kill them! No, no, no! ABS! Oh no, ABS, don't kill them! Please! No, we got them! <gasps> 73! You manage to take down your target. The rebels retreat to attack from another vector, and the local Federation commander-in-chief hurries you to leave. We'll try to hold this position a little longer to cover your escape. Get out of here. <laughs> Last second. How close are they to the base, though? Oh, my. We might have to skip that repair thing. They're really close to the base. Whew. Chase Station is about to be evacuated nearby. Some Federation engineer repurposed their shipyard to perform military repairs. I don't know if we have the time. I'm not gonna risk doubling the pursuit. But I'm gonna still sell them. But I'm just not gonna risk doubling the pursuit. So it's 15 scrap. What have they got? Advanced navigation, reverse ion field. Leviathan, heavy artillery battery that fires swarm of missiles. It is three damage to hold, but much less damage to system and crew. Thirteen seconds. One shot per charge. What have I got? Fourteen second. It's slightly faster. 
It does a bit of damage to rooms. I think it's better. It's better than our barrel mine launcher. Just slightly. Yeah, it's slightly better than the barrel mine launcher. Also, we need to pick our weapons. So the pike beam is gonna replace the light laser. Uh, there's no drone control. There's no drone control, so we're gonna sell the heavy ion drone. What do we put the Leviathan? Do we replace our dual laser? Our phase ion. This does sort of the same thing as the phase ion. Except it does one damage permanently. Right, we gotta replace the dual shot laser. Whew. Let's get that reverse ion field. It might save us. Let's get one point of fix for the hole. Okay, what do we need? Let's get... Let's get max power. And more engines. For more dodging. Oh my. Oh, they're really close to the base. We might have to skip this repair station. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm not gonna risk losing. An advanced rebel automated ship remains stationed near a near rebel space station. Sensor indicated it's a Sarge vessel for military goods. Attack him. Get the goods. Or avoid. Oh my god. He's got missiles. We might take a beating from those missiles. But we could get more upgrades, like another level of, of hacking. We're at maximum power right now, aren't we? Now let's just avoid. I wanna fight. Yeah, we, we gotta skip this repair station. Cause he's gonna jump. He's got two turns to get to the base. We gotta skip the repair station. I don't like it, but we gotta. As soon as you arrive at the beacon, a rebel cruiser turns to engage. How could they have gotten here so fast? They sent a message. This is the RS Arrested Development. Our fleet has encircled this, sec this entire sector and the Federation base will fall soon. You won't get out of this. Time to power up the weapons. Invisible, huh? And they got a drone to shoot down our missiles? That is slightly annoying. They're teleporting in. We can deal with that. This is not a capture situation though. This is clearly a we kill them situation. Man, those cloaking... Oh, teleporting bomb. That cloaking, it lasts a long time. Okay. Let's hack... Wait, that drone they have, will it shoot down my drone? It probably will, huh? That missed. Good. Um... What if... Uh... Can't see that... What happened to that drone? Let's try it. Now they, sh they shut it down. Okay. They shut it down. We got the phase ion. We got... Okay, we need to phase ion those those weapons. Uh, let's uh, mind control their pilot. Okay, that's good. Next up, we scatter laser around here. And then we use this pike beam on their everything. There we go. 
Very nice. We keep the Leviathan for now. We don't need them so much. Okay, they dodged. Uh, they're teleporting in. These guys are strong. Okay, we gotta get ready. Please, please dodge that bomb. Yeah, we dodged the bomb again. Perfect. We got another little surprise for them. In fact, Let's wait for one second, get the pilot, then we hit, then we hit the everything again. And we just need one more salvo. Baby J back on the engine, a street game back in your room. Okay. So stressful. Ah, oh, they turn invisible again. They're gonna teleport back in here. Okay. We got them. There we go. Now this is what we're gonna do to the final boss. This is the plan. The master plan. We still gotta kill these guys. They're annoying. There we go. Fifty-one. We can have more power to the med bay just in case. We can still have more power to the piloting, just in case. More power to the mind control, just in case. Oh my god. Choices. We're gonna take the med bay. If they board us... If they do, like, tons of damage to us, we need to be able to heal quickly if we have to. Like, the faster healing is pretty amazing. Now we need to hit the base. We're gonna get there at the same time as they do. That's it, guys. This is it. This is it. <laughs> the Rebel flagship. If you're able to destroy this monstrosity federation, we will have a chance of surviving. There's no turning back. Gonna grab a little bit of water. He's gonna turn invisible. Which is gonna be super annoying. He's gonna hack our med bay. That's all right. Okay, we need to hack the missiles. It's almost ready to fire. No, wait just a little bit. Hack the missile. Okay. Uh, take down probably the missiles, yeah. Take down the miss. This thing, maybe? Okay. Okay. Okay, we're mind controlling the pilot. Next, what are we gonna hit? Wanna hit we wanna do as much damage as quickly as possible. There we go. Very nice. Oh, they dodge. Okay, we're gonna take missile hit right here. <sighs> Alright, everyone, brace for impact. <sighs> yes, it's the bus, baby Jay. <laughs> this is it. Brace for impact. Okay, two hits. 
Not too bad. Sea Monkey. Uh, let's have Doom World go help Sea Monkey repair. Oh, we want to keep the dodging high. Okay. Scatter Flack. Let's get ready. I want to hit as many rooms as I can. Shit. Shit, they're dodging like crazy. The missiles are almost ready. But we can disable one of their missile charge. Okay, they're invisible again. So far so good, we only took two hit points of damage. And next time they become visible, we have a mind control to guarantee a hit. So let's mind control. Let's guarantee the hit. Ah crap, missiles heading our way. We can't dodge them. Okay, we took one hit. Damage control on the on the hacking, please. I need I need faster damage control on this hacking. Oh, we almost got them. We almost got first part down. We might have them right here. Yes! First part down. We took, what, three or four hit points of damage? <sighs> okay, get the ship back into ship shape. Hey, they're still shooting their laser at us. That's not gonna do anything. Silly rebels. We succeeded the first part of the final boss. Alright, now we need to get ready for the second part. We got a bit of scrap. Uh, we could put extra point in the mind control to prevent that from going down. If it gets hit. And I think that's worth it. Plus, if we want, we could re put our power more in the mind control and, and do more damage. All right, we're going to be fighting the drones next. The drones are super annoying. Super, super annoying. There's three parts to the final boss, unless unless Captain's Edition has added a fourth. I don't know, because I've only gotten to the second part. I don't think we have time to go there to the repair and back. We're gonna have to wait it out here. Yeah, here they come. Part two. You chase down the flagship and discover it is heavily damaged from the previous fight. Scan indicator has redirected considerable power to its drones. Get ready for a fight. The drones. Well, we don't have to deal with the ion anymore. So that's good. We still have to deal with the missiles. So the missile is its main damaging capability. The drones are going to be absolutely horrifying. What does this shoot down? Regular missiles, mines, and asteroids. Okay. I don't think we can survive the drones. We have to take down those drones. We need to time our missile with a drone attack. Oh, they're gonna board us. That's true, I forgot about that.
It's okay, we got a big intervention force. Okay, the Leviathan's about to shoot. I can't take missile hits. Oh, I shut down both! Damn it. Alright, let's mind control the pilot. Then we need to, uh, we need to start doing some damage. Oh! Shit! That was a preemptive click. We're gonna take a missile hit right here. These guys are nasty. Took down our pike beam. Oh my god. So much of everything going on. Did we... Uh, we still can't get a freaking... Drone to get there. God. Yeah, they're really, really doing a number on us. Missiles, okay. That's a small blessing. Oh shit, we have a Is that a boarding drone? Oh, crap. Crap. Power surge detected. Get missiles incoming. Oh, my God. Oh, oh no. Oh, we're taking such a beating. Oh, frick. We're taking too much damage. I can't hurt them. I wasn't looking at my health. And we got missiles incoming. And our weapons are depowered. Oh, that drone that keeps shooting down our missiles. That's the thing that's screwing us over. I remember, that's what screwed us over last time as well. Ah! That missed! No! Oh no! Uh, I think that's it, guys. I think that's it. Oh no! It's that drone that shoots down our missiles! We can't do any damage to them!
stage two again. This ship was so good. This ship was so good. We couldn't hit them with the missile. And it was just all the drones in the world. I mean, this part's always hard. I mean, for this part, you pretty much need, like, a teleporter. Or a cloaking. This was so close. This was so close. I need to plan more for the for the freaking drone stage. Well, we had a name suggestion. So we're going to use the name suggestion from last time. Hercules. Raw. Um who are we going to be, bring, be bringing on board this time? Okay, I think, I think we need... Um... Alright, this is, this is what we need. Sorry. I have too many papers on my desk. Okay, we need... Thomas Engine. Because Thomas Engine is awesome. We need... Um, we're gonna be bringing, uh, Phoenix Red Black. It's been a while. And I want to bring Socrates. There we go. <sighs> oh, baby Jay. Well, we'll find you. Don't worry about it. We'll find you. All right, well, here we go again. All right, we, we have learned we need a way to deal with the drones. We have to find a way to deal with that. Also, we need to find a way to capture enemy ships alive. A small research station orbits near a nearby pulsar. It appears largely abandoned. But you detect power signature flaring up as soon as you're in scanning distance. A small combat ship launches from the station. Pirates. Alright, we can take down those weapons. Oh no. Baby J ran out of air. Sorry. Alright, ion pulse. Where are they gonna hit? Alright. Okay. We might take a hit there. We can't... We don't have any shield, but we have 20 dodge. I think I'm not gonna risk taking a hit. I'd rather... Hey, we can try to, uh... Take down their oxygen. That might kill them. Now their weapons are back online. Now nah, we're just gonna kill them. It's one thing to, um take them alive, but you have to be able to do it without taking any hit points of damage, otherwise it's not worth it. 17 scrap, that's pretty decent. Alright, we're gonna wait for the uh, the shields to come back online before we jump, because we don't want to jump into a situation where our shields are depowered. There we go, and jump. Let's go into Nebula, I always like going into Nebula in the beginning. The ship emerged quite far away from the beacon. You see a rebel ship waiting nearby, undoubtedly stationed to look for you. Oh no, we need to find Baby J! You're on our way! Stop blocking the way! Oh, they have a missile. Let's attack him. Oh shit, weapons. Repower the weapons, maybe? Oh, that might have been the, the one second they needed to get a missile off. Hopefully that's a slow missile. Ah, crap. And we missed. Taking a hit here. Two hit points of damage. That hurts. There we go. Okay. Let's take down their piloting. Let's play it safe. Ah, oh, crap. Alright, well. Let's keep playing it safe. 
There we go. Get the weapons again. That's about to come back online. Ah, the dodging. It's unreal. There we go. They're charging their FTL, huh? Oh, we're gonna try to disable it. But we're probably gonna have to spend another missile. Yeah. Not gonna take a chance. We're gonna kill them. 16 scrap, two missile, and two hit points. Huh, I think we came out ahead, but not by a lot. Let's hit this. Then back here, and then the store. Here, here, here in the store. Yes. We need a lot of scrap before we head to a store. An unidentified ship is badly damaged and still being assaulted by a space pirate. The victim begins a distress message until the pirate cuts in and offers to split the bounty if you sit tight. Nah, we're gonna kill the pirate. Pirate's sh ship stops his pursuit and locks weapon onto your ship. Disable his weapons. That's a scary weapon. And that I don't remember what it does. I think it's pretty scary. I'm not gonna take any chance. I don't want to get hit. I want to. I don't want to take any damage. That scrap that comes out of my pocket. Come on. They're powering up the FTL, but they don't have a pilot right now. They're charging the FTL. Nope. Not worth it. We're gonna use the missile. We're low on missiles, though. 13 scrap. Okay, let's go examine him. Thank you for the aid. I'm an arms dealer that usually only works with rebels, but considering the circumstances, I'll make an exception. Let's see what he has to offer. We don't have anything to sell. Could buy some missiles. Drone control, crew teleporter. It's all too expensive. Alright, we should have destroyed the ship. Oh my god! All the stores in the world. Let's hit the distress, then this, then we have two stores. Alright, distress, nebula, two stores. Oh no, 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 giant spiders. I am not down with that. Uh uh. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I am not dealing with giant spiders. This part of Nebula seems to be not as uncharted as expected. An AI-controlled turret is guarding the beacon. The Rebels' new ships would have to stay in its weapon range to charge the FTL. A fight will be unavoidable. Oh, what? Uh, I'm sorry? What the hell? This is gonna be... Okay, okay. Listen... Crap! Okay. This is slightly annoying. Ship to fight. Yeah, by slightly annoying, I mean like the worst ship in the world to fight. What the hell? This is sector one. How does it have all this? It doesn't do much, but it's freaking annoying. Holy crap, look at all this health! This thing is insane! Charging is FTL, huh? No. Oh! oh! Wow, we hit it through the... Oh my god! 
This thing is so annoying! This thing is the freaking worst! Seven! Wait, wait. Seven scrap for that? In sector one, that ship, seven scrap. Super fair. This beacon seems to serve as a meeting place for local traffic. It seems you can find crew willing to fight on your ship here for a price. I think we found ABJ. Because 39 scrap for a Zoltan? Look at our ship! Look at how screwed up our ship is from that thing. Alright. Welcome back, baby J. I mean, it's cash that we could have spent on weapons at a store, but to be honest, I think this is worth it. Look at the damage that thing did to our ship. That's insane. The new baby J! <laughs> new and improved! You now emit a, a faint glow of power everywhere you go. And you kind of smell like raspberries. Thing, man, that ship was completely, completely overpowered. All right, everyone, back to your stations. Baby J, you're gonna be working the shields. There we go. All right, now we can hit the store, but we have almost nothing, which is not the best. Um, no, we don't have time. Well, good news, there was nothing of, uh, of interest here. Uh, now there's not much point of me going to that store, really, because I don't have any enough scrap to buy anything. So let's just move forward. I mean, yeah, we might get something at this beacon, which we, and we, we're not gonna get anything at the store. A small rebel research station overlooks a pulsating star. Before you can react, a rebel ship spots you and move in to attack. Okay. <laughs> oh, crap. Okay. No weapons for you. We're very low on missiles. We need to take one point of damage here. Okay, no. That disabled their weapons. I'm gonna be safe for a little while. They got some good repairers in there. As long as our weapons don't get disabled. Charging the FTL. Now they can't. Haha! <laughs> Thank you, Ion Storm! Yes! 16 scrap. And jump. Now we can still hit the store, but that's getting a bit dangerous. Let's hold up for the second sector. Alright, recycle some fuel. It's always good. A distress. Let's go check it out. Discovered that the distress signal originates from the center of a nearby system. A civilian vessel passed too close by the local sun. Their engines and shield were damaged by a solar flare, and now they're in danger of drifting into the star. Let's try to rescue their crew. 
Right as you're about to dock, another flare blasted to the civilian craft. The damners barely managed to compensate the impact. Most of the ship crew suffered terminal radiation burn. The ones you managed to save are grateful. You'll drop them off at the next station. Nine scrap for one damage? That's actually alright. We just need to get that fire under control. And then the repairs. And then all three of you needs healing. Come on, quickly before the next flare. Okay. We jump. Over here, maybe? Awesome! Your arrival is greeted by numerous computer alerts. The nearby automated rebel scout has deployed a virus and disrupted your shield system. Hopefully it won't cause further problem before you can destroy it. You program an attack plan, redirect power to other system. Um Uh what? We're gonna take such a beating here. There's nothing we can do about this. If he dodges this shot... Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What the f... What is this? This is the end of this ship! I'm not kidding! This is the end of this ship! I can't jump away! I can't do anything! I can't do anything to this ship! I am not even kidding right now that I can't do anything to this ship. Oh my god! What the hell was that?! What the hell was that? Scrap for that. <laughs> that was, that was, <laughs> that was so bad. Man, these Sector One ships. I don't need, I don't need any fuel. Oh, frick me! Put our small rebel ship nearby. It seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. It does not seem to want to engage you. Demand the surrender of their goods. Really? You're you're not fitted for combat? Could have fooled me. What's with the dodging? We're out of missiles. Oh no! This is crap! 
We hit them! One of those ships that has a really, really rocky start. The zone of forgiveness, that's Zoltan's. Brick in red space. Let's go to the brick in red space. We want to fight people. Standard engines. Recycle the fuels. We're out of missiles. We're out of. Your jump leads to a remarkable binary star system. Oh my god. The view is beautiful, but there is nothing else around. As you wait for the FTL to charge, you suddenly feel the cold barrel of a blaster gun press into your neck. Sorry, Captain, I was spying for the rebels all along. This this ship is gone. I have already informed the fleet of your position. A patrol ship is on its way. Treason. Nope. You sure you remember that you respect them regardless of where their allegiance lay before? This does not have to end in bloodshed. You propose that they can still be part of your crew. The rebel spy is surprised. They stopped the thing for a second. Ah, whatever. I never liked these idiots anyway. Let's take on this rebel ship. They return to their station. You can talk about this later because as promised, a rebel ship, a rebel ship jumps in. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. I'm not kidding right now when I'm saying we're dead. We're dead. Now the game is smart enough not to let me know who backstabbed me because they would be out the airlock. I mean we can jump away I guess. those bombs do any damage though well look at that we're gonna be able to take this guy Capital ship gets ready to ignite its, its FPL. It, it tries to expand. If it gets away, it will certainly inform the rest of the fleet of your position. The fleet has already been in form of my position. You're not gonna quadruple their, like... No. You don't get to get away after that. You don't get to just walk away. Fifteen. One five. Fifteen. Scrap. For that fight. Yeah. 15.
Once you arrive, your screen lights up with warnings. A nearby pirate seems to have advanced hacking tools and they have tried to shut down your engines. Your crew managed to keep them barely operational before you move in to attack. We do have one missile. This ship is doomed. They're repairing so fast. At least they can't damage us. This is, this is such a bad start. Nine. Yeah, that seems like it was worth nine scrap. I can't find a store I can't repair. Once you have at the location of the distress call, a small cargo ship hails you. Shiny! Glad you're not another pirate. We we're ambushed by some outlaws and our shield power couplers were damaged beyond repair. We have energy but can't get our shields stabilized properly. If it comes to another fight, they'll be totally defenseless. Let's have a Zoltan crew energize their, their shields. You duck with the ship and your Zoltan calmly walks to the shield room. The being does not touch anything, just concentrate for a few seconds, and suddenly lights flicker. Power level increase and the ship's shield bubble come up strong. The crew of the cargo ship is amazing, quite grateful. Not sure we would have had a chance to get home alive without you. We're alone scrap, but we can give you some of our goods as compensation. They sell real good in far off sectors, like nebulas and pirate territories. Okay. I think this is a pirate territory. An advanced rebel automated ship remains stationed near a small rebel station. However, without function sensor, it is impossible to tell what's inside. Let's attack it. They have two... ...shields. Can we even take it on with one missile? Nope. Here's a store, but we got nothing! We need to keep jumping until we get enough scrap to even fix the ship. I'm gonna fight this ship. Screw you! That thing's gonna fire before we can. Oh! Nice. Nice! Oh, these guys didn't have any luck. No missiles. Yeah, it was our last missile, but I'd rather fire a missile than lose a hit point right now. 15 scrap and a missile. Alright, come on. Such a bad... I don't, I, it's, it pisses me off because the last ship we had was so good. It was so, so good. And then... And then this. This is what we get. Bird after the resistor jump completion before your ship warns you of a station with weapons locked that floats right in front of you. Let's go! Let's take down those weapons. Yeah, that's... the missiles are still online though. Okay. We need to keep just hitting the the weapons. We do not want that missile. To... Oh, resisted, huh? 
That's how it's gonna be. We just don't want that missile to fire ever. If we could just keep it so that the fire, the missile never fires, we'll be fine. Stop resisting damage. It's gonna be a long one. We can settle in and have a little chat. Actually, their weapons are down. We can take down their shields. No time for chatting, guys. There we go. Now we can do two damage to the weapon. There we go. Now the shield. Wait, did I click accept? Oh, I didn't mean to click. Well, we got a thing to sell. And we got screwed on the exit here. All right, what they got? They have a ter cargo teleporter, and they're gonna sell. They're gonna buy this for eighty scraps. And they got a light laser. Well, wow. things have sort of changed around. I mean, our missiles are better than that. My god. My god. Suddenly, what the hell is this? Let's get the repairs. Let's get some missiles, I guess. Actually, no. Let's get some ship. Let's get one missile. Then let's get some ship upgrades. Like sensors. And... And that's it for now. Wow! What a turnaround! Seriously! What a turnaround! I was not expecting that at all. An unidentified ship is badly damaged and still being assaulted by a space pirate. The victim begins a distress message until the pirate cuts in and offers to split the bounty if you sit tight. Nope, we're gonna be a hero. They have some healing and some weapons. Take down that, uh, that healing. How do we do this? Considering miss sending a missile. Oh, that's nice. That's a fire. There we go. Oh no, come on. Yes. 
Okay, this guy's gonna be a lot slower. Oh crap, he repaired it. Come on. There we go. No, 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 no. No more generous bribe. We're taking your ship alive. Now there's a hole in the hole that you have to fix before you can fix the thing. Come on, uh, they're fixing too fast. I think we're gonna kill their ship. They're fixing too fast. Yeah. Ah, uh, we tried. Oh, 22 scrap and an uh, extra 17. Okay. Not bad, actually. <laughs> yeah, I mean... I was, I was ready to, like, throw the blade, uh, throw the towel on this one. Sometimes. Okay, now we could upgrade our engines and get one extra jump every time, which I think I'm gonna do. You've arrived at a busy long-range beacon, a massive jump relay that can throw ship at a great distance. You can use this intel chip to travel to another sector. You come across an asteroid mining colony. They message you immediately saying, Greetings, our supplies of mining explosives have run out ever since the rebel blockaded the system. Do you have any extra explosive? We'll solve your problem by launching a missile! While I appreciate your enthusiasm, we have certain protocols for the use of explosive around the workplace. Launching a military-grade weapon to our minds is exactly what I would call union-friendly. Sorry, I don't have enough. I just had a good look out there. We'll try to make do with what we have. Alright. So... Alright. Well... It's been over an hour, so thanks a lot for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. I'm a bit sad that Hope didn't make it, and I was gonna abandon all hope with Hercules, but suddenly turn of event? It's not looking too bad for Sector 2. If you've enjoyed this, please consider leaving a like, um, subscribing, or sharing it with your friend. That helps a lot. If you want to be part of the crew, if you have ship name ideas, uh, strategy, suggestions for other games, Send, leave me a comment, send me a message, or come chat with me live on Twitch. Speaking of, there's a link in the description below to my Twitch page if you're on YouTube, and if you're on Twitch, there's a link to my YouTube page, where you can see a bunch of my other videos, namely XCOM 2 when it comes out in, like, very soon. But anyway, until next time, bye-bye.